Master, it is almost three o'clock in the morning. You must get some sleep. Well, I have to finish these reports, Jeannie. Oh, very well, then. I will stay here and keep you company. Oh. oh, look, Master. There is a new movie about Cleopatra opening at the Rialto tomorrow. May we go? Oh, I'm sorry, Genia. I'm getting ready for an Apollo Earth orbit flight. I'm afraid I can't take you. Mm -hmm. Why don't you go alone, hmm? Oh, no, Master. I will wait until you are free. Hmm. I love stories about kings and queens. They are so exciting. <laughs> Mm. Yes, sure. Oh, gosh. I wish you would go to bed. No, it's all right. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, just gonna rest my eyes here for a minute. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dr. Bell wants to see you. Yeah, what for? I don't know. He just said he wanted to drop by his office. Hey, did you take your examination yesterday? Yeah. How'd you make out? Oh, all right, I guess. Well, all I know is he wants you to drop by. I guess I better get cleaned up, huh? Yeah. You think I got a couple ideas about what are you doing tonight? Come in. Good morning, Dr. Bell. Good morning, Major. Nothing like isometric exercises for keeping up body tone. Oh, yes, of course. Uh, Major Healy said you wanted to see me, sir. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Uh, sit down, Major Nelson. You were scheduled to go on the Apollo Earth orbit mission this week. Yes, sir. I've been working on Project Rainbow and... Did you say... Did you say we're scheduled? I'm afraid you're not going to be able to go. But I've been training for that mission for six months. I'm aware of that. Perhaps you've been overtraining, Major. Well, is there anything wrong with my reflexes? Or... Oh, no, it's not your reflexes. It's your eyes. My eyes? Your right eye, specifically. Uh, you're suffering from eye strain. Have you been doing an unusual amount of uh, reading or paperwork lately? Well, uh, just the usual reports regarding the mission, but I I'm sure any eye strain is just temporary. I'm sure it is, Major, but... Uh, meanwhile, you're grounded. Well, sir, you can't ground me. I'm, I'm... <laughs> I'm sorry, Major. I understand your disappointment, but as chief medical officer, it's my responsibility to evaluate the fitness of all personnel. You fail the eye test. However, I'm going to give you another eye examination in the morning so that we can determine the best course of treatment. Oh, I see. Well, that's, that's very kind. Afterward, um, why don't you take a month off and uh, go fishing somewhere? Hmm? Well, thank you, sir. I hope you don't mind if I appeal this to General Peterson. Mm, no. And I've never felt better in my life, General. Now, Dr. Bellows will tell you that with the exception of this uh, slight eye strain in my right eye, I'm in perfect health. Yesterday, I passed my physical and I checked out 100%. I don't believe there's anybody on the base that knows more about Project Rainbow than I do. And, well, after all, we're not going to be reading eye charts up there, are we? <laughs> so, if you would give me the green light, I could go ahead with my pre-flight briefing. I'm sorry to go over your head on this, Dr. Bellows, but, uh, General... Peterson understands a little bit more about these kind of things than you do. Isn't that right, sir? That's right, Tony. You're grounded. 